Abdur Kul Shaiwat Biwa Samus Patimta Rawat. Greetings. All right, this is in correlation with the videos that I've been posting uh, pertaining to larceny, grand theft, treason, crimes against humanity, uh, genocide. These officers are insured by the county of Riverside, by the city, by the state, and they need to have their bonds and their insurances leaned, removed, revoked. Um, what I wanted to share is a penal code, California penal code. Um, pertaining to these officers who are making reports, false statements in the reports. As I personally called Narita L Copyright Trademark, these corporations and gave them the facts, evidenced them the facts, had reports from what I shared and their reports aren't, uh, they don't match up. So this penal code right here states that our penal code 118.1 makes it a crime for California peace officers to put a knowingly false statement in a police report, even if it is not a sworn statement made under oath. A violation is a wobbler that prosecutors can charge the crime as either a misdemeanor or a felony. So you see Sergeant Schaefer, Lieutenant Eric Dittmer, Officer James Hiding, these individuals work together and are not so organized criminals. And the mandates that the DMV and the state of California has um, have not been met. So these officers want to make it seem as if it's a civil case, yet I'm not a civilian, nor am I uh, within the jurisdiction of the United States of America, which was dissolved October 12th, 2021. Uh, these agents are rogue agents, uh, treasonous agents, and um, they need to be prosecuted by their higher ups, by their authorities, being that they are agents who took an oath of office, and I won't get into their oath because their oath is constitutional oath, which is voided, so their oath is fraudulent. So it's a real slippery slope for the, these gentlemen who are organized criminals. Um, and again, the vehicle was registered and is registered to an Asim Najiyaz Moore Bay copyright trademark. The vehicle was stolen May 1st, 2020. And on the Gregorian calendar to date is March 8th, 2022 on the Gregorian calendar. All white. So this should be sufficient, ample enough time, energy, space, for Mayor Patricia Locke Dawson to remedy this situation, get the board members of the county uh, involved, follow the trail of money. Most likely one of them board members is benefiting, if not all. I've already reached out to them on the 4th. Today is the 8th. Four days have passed and they have not responded. All white, Ebu Gador. I look forward to communicating with you, Mayor, soon, or your attorneys, or agreeable entities and energies that would like to progress and move forward and have remedy. So have remedy for themselves and have remedy for the people and who aren't tyrants. I look forward to that. Hotep.